Welcome to our new video about extracting part number and name from part name. On our website you can see the full code and read more about string operations. Let's run this code in one part first. Here you can see full code. Let's check these two parameters first. We will delete these inputs. And now let's run this code. It is very fast as you can see and we got what we want, extracted part number and name from part name. Let's try our application now, it works in product. So you can select as many parts as you want, they will be added to the list. In every part we made two additional parameters string 1 and string 2. To show you how can you use any parameter, you just need to change it in application. You need to be defined in assembly for macro to work. After that, just hit start macro button. As you can see relations are created for all parts from the list. Thanks for watching and we hope that you will learn something from this example. Follow our YouTube channel and website.